it seems the 2020 with the going year has cost me a more but it has brought some long pending goods also i wanted a dds vfo my friend view to you peaks tried to make one and our dev guru view to dev silent key had gifted me one dds vfo uh, and one of my friend on the facebook said he is making the dds vfo and i was just surprised i wanted to make some uh, general coverage receiver and needed a dedicated dds vfo and i was actually seeking the uh what we say is simple vfo but this is for super hat it has setting of if without if you cannot make it a plain one i said okay it cost me up approximately 1k and seeing the technology and cost i thought it is worth it so it should contain uh dds vfo chip programmed fully programmed so these are the two things okay the rotary encoder and connectors good we have fed matching good uh i will not power on i will just test it okay wow this is Arduino programmer it is fully programmed uh, there should be a small chip somewhere here voltage regulator crystal wow so it is a super hat vfo hmm we to wet 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 wow 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 so it will display my name in the next part we will see and i am planning to make a super hat receiver so we will see at that time okay okay 12 volt is given and before powering up I made a few exchanges of WhatsApp and uh, he told me what to do so it starts from 3 megahertz and that is 80 meter band and you see the lsd and usb it contains bfo as well as vfo so it will adjust its bfo and vfo accordingly uh, this is 1 megahertz with push 1 hertz push the switch and it will change then hertz Hundred hertz, one kilohertz. Push it, and it becomes ten. 
push it 100 kilohertz once again push it and it becomes 1 megahertz tip size from it is a continuous cyclic VFO so uh, after uh, 30 megahertz it jumps to 3 megahertz this is uh, something uh, uh, different than other BFOs so it is good for super hat transmitter and receiver it is not meant for uh, CW but I think we can receive the CW also a good one liked it and hope to incorporate into one of my receiver let's see oh i am thankful to sudindra uh, this is his address in the bangalore for sending me this and i like the way it working and i recommend everybody who is not able to make bfo bfo himself should try out his design uh, in home brewing it is not necessary that you brew yourself everything if the, someone has brewed very good thing you get it from them now he is uh, making it available so cost is also a reasonable one and after the usage I will let you know what was the result it will be a good result <laughs> 